That was Snoop Dogg, Gin and Juice. So, of course, another mass shooting uh, in, uh, in in the United States of America. This one, with this one at uh, Michigan State University. Uh, it is so commonplace that we can't even feign shock anymore. Um, it's interesting now how our politicians, you know, the uh, solutions that they have, they want to protect us in front from uh, woke. They want to protect us from CRT. They want to protect our, the children uh, from drag shows. Uh, they wanted to protect him from mask at one time. They want to protect him from everything except what is truly a danger to them in school. Now, we've said this before. We've been shot at synagogues, at churches, at grocery stores, at schools. So uh, with, with such redundancy, it is galling. It boggles the mind. And the, the steady uh, a stream of politicians give us our feckless, give us their feckless prayers and thoughts and do nothing because they are in the pocket of the gun lobby. And when when things like this happen, gun sales go up. So these are, this is like a free advertisement. But the thing that I found so troubling and so sad and so indicative of where we are is there was a young girl who was, who was now attending middle, middle uh, excuse me, uh, Michigan State University. But years ago, she attended Sandy Hook. So this young lady has the misfortune to be involved in two mass shootings. Two, the same young lady and two mass shootings. One when she was a little girl and one now that she's an adult, a young adult. And we have done nothing to protect her. Nothing. If a child shall leave them, what does this mean? That's how commonplace it is. This young lady was involved in two mass shootings. And this isn't the first time that we've heard about this. It's getting redundant. It's getting to the point we, we have to stop even pretending to care. Stop with the thoughts and prayers if you're not going to do anything about it. Faith without works is dead and so are our children. You can protect them from everything. You get mad. A lot of Republicans, uh, 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 politicians on the right get mad that Biden didn't shoot down a balloon fast enough. What are you doing about these things? that are? I don't know what's in that balloon, but I know far too many things that are in our schools that are endangering our, our children. What are we going to really do? Let's stop saying things like our, th our prayers and our thoughts with the family. They're not. What you're going to keep doing is taking the gun lobby money and turning your deaf ear and eye to people because you don't care. What you care about is power and being reelected. You don't care. These right to lifers, why are they so silent now? Aren't these lives? Aren't these young children? Aren't, don't they deserve a full life? The only things you care about is uh, obviously abortion. You care about, uh, uh, you know, keeping black history out of schools. You keep about, care about drag shows, but you do not care about the things that are actually. I heard somebody actually had the temerity to say that Joe Biden closed the school, which is a lie. You know, that was under the Trump administration. But what is happening after administration, after administration, after administration is people are determined to turn the deaf ear and deaf eye when our children are being slaughtered in the streets. You will protect them from black history. You just won't stop them from becoming history. That's a little note from the GED section. We've got the Jazz Report coming up in 15 minutes. It is the D.L. Hughley Show.